Hi everyone and welcome to this new unboxing video of the Mifa exclusive of the first four figure line. If you like this video, don't forget to uh, hit the subscribe button down below and also give us a thumbs up because that will really help us grow this channel, of course. My name is Moena and this is the Optimus Gaming YouTube channel. Let's see how the uh, box came in. Well, as you can see, it came in pretty decently. Uh, I know for a fact that a couple of uh, post mail companies uh, like to throw uh, all the boxes around, but as you can see, it has uh, been delivered uh, quite well. Let's open it. So, be careful. I'm going to do this very carefully. Let's see. Where right, can I open it? There we go. Really carefully opening it. But we do not want to damage the package, of course. And there we have it, another box within this box. So, um, as we all know from First Four Figures, they really, really pay attention on uh, the safety of the box because in here, of course, is the box of the statue itself. Um, so they give this a uh, padding and it, I know for a fact it's also uh, on the bottom side uh, This is what's it called styrofoam or whatever it is uh, and, it, and it really helps uh, Making sure that you get your package nice and safely. It's really sturdy. It's really it's not going anywhere So um, Let's remove these ones don't throw them away because if you want to store your uh, uh, package later or if you want to sell it later, I don't advise it because they're, it, it's really uh, a really cool um, statue. Then, uh, yeah, you really want to have those. And there we have the box with the uh, figurine inside. Look at all those details. I mean, the logo, the image, the names, the uh, logo first for figures. And look at all those detailing. Uh, on the box itself and also that's not the only uh, print that they have let's remove this one real quick um, the Zelda Breath of the Wild uh, logo another logo with the name also the uh, uh, the product number um, and of course another logo here as well okay let's open it up let's see where you are there you are let's be very careful because there is the box inside. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And there we have it. So once I open this up, the first thing that you will notice is that there is another cardboard uh, sheet inside, which is basically for protection. Like you open up with a knife or whatever and that you don't accidentally uh, hit the, uh, the box itself. So that's really a nice attention to detail from First for Figures as well. I really like that. So as you can see, the uh, package comes in with another box. But this is basically the uh, exclusive uh, box. And I really like those boxes because they're so detailed. It's incredible. So let's see if I can remove this without too much of a hassle. Oh, there we go. Ah, there we go. Look at this. Awesome. So let me let me put that right here. So as you can see, it comes in a plastic bag uh, that really helps me uh, removing it from the outer box. So let's see and look at this. Oh God, I really I really like these uh, boxes. I will show you in a sec. Give me a moment. Da -da 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 -da. Look at this box. Look how it shines, how it's so shiny. So again, there's a lot of detail, right? So basically it's the same as what was on this box, of course, but now in color and a little bit more beautiful. Um, so what we have is a lot of detail, uh, the name, the imagery, uh, the logos. And again, there are some logos on the side as well, as you can see. And also on the bottom, oh, let me turn it the right way. There we go. 
and also with the product number. So let's take a look inside. Well, there we go. So the first thing that you'll notice is when you open the box, this uh, authentication card will be uh, available for you. So as you notice, I'm going to take it out for a little bit. Um, it's wrapped in plastic, very protective. And um, yeah, then this is your uh, authentication card. Looks really cool, right? So if you use this one, this, this, this label or whatever it is, you can just pull off this slate, which is loose. Letting this aside and there we have the official uh, box. It's nicely wrapped with this translucent paper. So let's take a look at what is inside. So there we go. So there she is. Well, as you can see, we have the, uh, the, the box uh, here uh, and it's wrapped with this translucent paper and I think it's also for protection. Uh, so again, uh, first four figures are really uh, uh, paying a lot of attention to the detail, to the packaging, to make sure that you get the best product that they can uh, give you. So thumbs up for that. Really appreciate that. So let's uh, unwrap this. Let's see. I don't like to rip it, so uh, there we go. And look at this gorgeous box. Um, as you notice, we already have a couple of uh, Zelda statues, and of course, uh, Rivali is here as well. Um, so basically the, uh, the box is in the same line, of course. So you have the details here, the name of the statue, and of course the uh, imagery of the statue, and of course the figurine itself. Yeah, there's a lot of detail going on here as well. And um, yeah, don't forget the uh, Shika symbol on top. I yeah, there we go. You can see it like so. Um, so yeah, it's really, uh, really cool. So uh, that was all about the box. Let us continue to the figurine itself. So um, on the top part, you can open it up. Just be careful. Uh, there's a tape here that you can cut through and then you can open it up. Oh, I forgot that there were a couple of tapes here as well. Again, be very careful. You don't want to damage the box. So, there we go, and I hope I got all the tapes, but I think so. And let's open it up. Oh, look at this. They really paid attention to this as well. So, as you open it, you notice that there are two symbols of the divine beast, uh, Faruta, right? So, that is basically the divine beast that is Mipha, that Mipha is controlling, so having those uh, symbols here is really uh, a nice detail as well. Uh, let's continue opening the box and get, it, get the fi figurine out. I hope this works. I think I need to uh, set it, this one a little bit aside. There we go. There she is. Look at this. Awesome. So what's in the box? There's this, uh, let's put Mifa here for a sec. So there's this pamphlet, which explains a little bit more about uh, how you can uh, transform this box into a diorama uh, with a Mifa background. So if you prefer that, then you can do that as well. As well as all the other uh, statues. Let me see if yeah, there we go. With all the stat other statues uh, available in this uh, Breath of the Wild line as well. Uh, and also uh, on the back, there are is a 500 reward, 500 point reward for uh, yeah as a thank you gift. So don't throw this away because these are valid points, right? And we all know. Uh, 
the, uh, that the first four finger points are really uh, helpful in collecting. So the first thing that you notice is when you remove her from the box is that she is again protected by a plastic cover. This actually makes sure that the statue doesn't move anywhere, right? So in the box, it doesn't move at all, which basically protects all of the uh, details like her uh, light skill trident, of course, uh, and uh, all the other uh, details that are on the statue. So again, uh, first for figures really pays attention about protection, 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 protection of the figurine. So now I'm going to remove the plastic cover. Please be careful with this. Um, I know that it can be a, a little bit tricky to do so because it's uh, being pressed uh, into each other. So uh, really be try to be careful uh, opening it up. Let's see if I uh, can open it up really. Ooh, nothing broke, don't worry. And the other ones, there we go, last one. As I mentioned, it can be very tricky to open this. There's some plastic there that I'm going to remove real quick. And there she is. Let's get her out of the box. And look at this. Look at this gorgeous statue. Oh my god. Wow. She looks absolutely amazing. Look at this. Look at all the details, uh, the coloring, etc. etc. Wow. And a funny thing that I already noticed is that they actually paid attention uh, on detailing. I mean, if you, if you can see um, the, uh, the, 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 the beat here on her trident actually hang down, right? So uh, that's really a nice detail. Uh, which I wanted to uh, to explain uh, to you guys. What an awesome statue. Um, so also, uh, one thing that was awesome in the box is your USB cable. So um, the exclusive version comes uh, with a uh, lit uh, platform and you can use either a battery or the uh, USB cable to, uh, uh, to uh, light it on. So don't forget, don't throw it away. Uh, this should be below your statue as well. So here is the statue of Mifa. So let's take a look at some of the close-up of the statue. Okay guys, that is it for today. The unboxing of the Mifa exclusive first fur figure figurine. All I can say is that I am going to enjoy this figurine very much and especially with all the other figurines as well. And personally, I cannot wait to have every uh, statue included. If you guys like this video, then don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below or give this video a thumbs up. And that was it for today. Again, my name is Rowena, signing off. See you guys in the next video. Bye!